grade never stop learning. Under new state curriculum guidelines, fifth graders are required to study the human body and how it works. So teachers at One Mountain School decided a hands-on experiment would enhance their classroom experience. And as you'll see, we think they're right. <laughs> we want some healthy hearts, right? Come on, my grandma runs faster than that. Oh. Run, run, run. <laughs> Students at Appleton Intermediate School are increasing their heart rate. Then they use a straw taped to their wrist to see and count the beats. It's a way for the students to better understand the circulatory system. Hmm. And in another experiment, red goo mixed with a borax acid solution helps them to see how the digestive system works. The fifth graders say after seeing how the body works, it might be a good idea to take better care of it. Um, maybe eating healthier foods or just um, doing um, more activities outside, um, workout, stuff like that. We got to learn about new things that we, some people didn't really know about. Like, I didn't know that the respiratory system had like kidney and liver. And I learned all these new words and parts of the body that I never learned about. But the heart is like how the blood comes in our body and pumps. And yes, in case you're wondering, that is a real heart from a cow, as well as its liver and kidneys. Mmm, boy, that looks yummy, huh? <laughs> Mr. Keaton with the High Touch High Tech is leading the experiments in the anatomy class, eventually involving all 425 fifth graders at Emblem Intermediate School. I can't help think of how that goo might fit in your stomach, all the holiday eating and consuming of all this food. I'm not so hungry.